What the hell is this? Okay, Tad, that... What is it doing on your phone? Good luck explaining this one. Where do you think you're going? I'm going to find Colby. No, you're not. You're going to stay right here. She wants to be alone. She needs to talk to her father. She doesn't need your help for that, and I need some answers. Dad, I can only imagine what you're thinking no. right now. What I'm thinking is I want the truth from both of you. Now, Liza told me you kissed her. You've already admitted well, to that. Well, that's because he no, did. Just a sec, just a sec. Now you're telling me that before that happened that she set you up intentionally to upset Colby yes. because it would cause trouble between the two of you. Yes. Is there something you want to add to that? He deserves the truth, you know. And that is why I'm going to give it to him. Okay, so the night that I supposedly hit on Damon, supposedly, I was really drunk, and I ran into Damon, and he offered to drive me home. I can't believe you're doing so this. So he takes me to my place, and he takes me upstairs, and now, mind you, I'm completely out of it. I don't know what is going on. I take myself to the bathroom to start to get undressed. I assumed that he was going to leave, but he was still there. And that's when he started to say really inappropriate things. What? And that's when he took those pictures. Don't know why he took those pictures. <laughs> you know exactly why. Oh, uh, maybe he wanted to show his friends, right? The whole Mrs. Robinson thing. Who? Mi who? Oh. You, are you kidding? Please don't tell me you're believing this crap. Uh, it's not crap. It's the truth. She's lying. Really? Why do you think I've been so uncomfortable to be around him? Why do you see I never wanted to be alone with him? Because you knew what I had on you. Or maybe it's because you crossed the line. And I was afraid that you were going to do it again, just like you did when you kissed me. So what? Is this the part where you kicked me out? No. No, it's the part where you get real. You know what I mean? Real. I don't care if it hurts. <laughs> Bye. Hi, Daddy. Um, I'm sorry I hung up on you like that. I just really wanted to see you, but I understand it wasn't your fault. You couldn't make it. Um, hey, could you send the plane for me when the timing works? There's actually something really good in my life. Or I should say, someone. <laughs> Damon. I, I wanted to tell you this in person, but I can't wait. Dad. Damon and I are in love. You would do anything to make me Damon. look bad, huh? Oh. Colby's not around, so you just cut me down Damon. the pad, right? Stop it. Don't make things worse. Just tell me what happened. She wasn't even drunk that night. Oh, please. No, 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 you... just a sec, just a sec, let him talk. She faked the whole thing to get me to drive her back to her place. And you did? Yeah, I did. And then she did this whole act about how she couldn't get out of her dress. She needed help with the zipper. So you volunteered. I helped her. Zip. That was it. The plan was to have Colby walk in on us and dump me on the spot. She was ready to take it as far as she had to. Okay, you see this? This is absolutely crazy. I would never break my daughter's heart like that. What? Like that? You mean like the way that your mom broke yours? You know, it actually makes perfect sense considering your whole whacked out mommy deal. You told him about that? She told me the whole story. How you slept with her mom and blew her world apart. Okay, Tad, that just slipped out, but that is not the Liza issue here. was ready to do to Colby exactly what you and her mom did to her, just to break us up. It's pretty sick when you think about it. I love my daughter more than life itself. I would never do that to my daughter, and you know that, and you know me. I mean, please, look at all that Damon has done. Tad, I know that you wanted to think that he was getting better. He was just able to hide it for a little while, at least. You know you've been screwing up all over the place lately, Get right? Out of my face. Get out of my face. Right, shut up, shut up, both of you. Just give me a minute. One of you is lying. And I'm going to figure out who. who has a history of lying here. Whatever, baby mama. Oh, uh, that's right, you weren't actually you pregnant this, that whole time. This is time. what I'm talking about. This is exactly what I'm talking about. He's acting the same way he did before he was even on those meds. Oh, God, please tell me you didn't stop taking your meds. Hmm. 
You did not really just ask me it's that. It's just a simple question. Yes, yes or no? I'm taking my meds, okay? Wait, want, me, want me to pee in a cup? Nice, that's no, wait, really wait, nice. Wait, 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 if what you're telling me is true, then why didn't you say something? If she was there and you were there, why wouldn't you come to me and admit it? Because the night that it happened. You're so into her. I didn't Try again. Fine. There's got to be more to it than that. What is it? Since I had those pictures, which I took for proof, by the way, not because I have something for moms, I figured I could use them. Get Liza to back off. Didn't work so well, obviously. Whatever, I'm out of here. Where are you going? I'm going to find Colby. She's got to be on the phone by walking now. out. You're going to take off all over again. There's like no you point always sticking do. around That's here, That's the answer it's to your pretty problem. obvious whose side you're on. Don't, don't. If I hear one more word you about how my, you're, you're my dad, you'll going. be my side no matter... Wait, stop! You're no better than Paul. Hey. 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 I'm sorry I ran out like that. I just needed to reach my dad. I get it. And my it's mom, fine. I can't even deal with her anymore. She's completely insane. Did you talk to Adam? Voicemail, but I mean, at least I got to apologize, right? He'll understand. Yeah, I hope so. I mean, he kind of has to. He's my dad. <sighs> hey, are you okay? Yeah, yeah, I'm cool. So, do I even want to know what happened in there? No, you don't. You know what? You are right. Let's not talk about them. Let's not talk about my mom, Tad, my dad, or anyone else. Let's just talk about us. Things are pretty perfect before they barged in, huh? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, they were. I don't know why I let them do that. He, one of these days. He's not in the place that he can hear you. Hear me? Why? Why? Why, why, why should he hear me? I don't know what I'd say. You know, I don't know what the hell's going on. Oh, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I, I know he's your son. You want to think the best of him. I just wish he wouldn't make it so damn hard on you. Oh, look at your face right now. Oh, sweetheart. You see, this is the reason why I tried to keep this insanity from you. I couldn't bear the thought of you being hurt. I honestly don't know what I am. I know. I know. I know this is a lot. But I'm telling you that it's it's going to be okay. All right? We are going to be okay. You know, that night that you showed up on my doorstep and you said that you wanted to give it another try. God, I was so excited. I couldn't bear the thought of ruining that. That's what it happened? Oh, God, no. Not the night before Jake and Amanda's wedding. The night I showed up your place, da Damon was there the night I came to your apartment? Yes.